Breaking developments tonight surrounding the company subcontracted to fumigate a Palm City home where a family says their 10 year old was poisoned by the chemicals that were used. We go right to Jared Worksma on the paperwork he just received surrounding Sunland Pest Control. Jared? Kelly, that's right. We had just received this report from the Florida Department of Agriculture. After months of investigation into Sunland Pest Control, the state has officially revoked the company's pest control license. The state has also taken the pest control operator's certificate away from the company's CEO, Grinnell Williams. Now, those uh, who are familiar with the story will remember 10 year old Peyton McCaughey was left with catastrophic brain damage after the August fumigation, according to his family. The McCaughey family originally hired Terminex for the job, but Terminex subcontracted to Sunland Pest Control. Now, the state's investigation turned up numerous problems, including faulty equipment and lack of training. The McCaughey family has since filed suit against Terminex, Sunland, and most recently, the chemical manufacturer in Cystix. Now, again, the breaking news tonight Sunland Pest Control uh, stripped of its license by the state. CEO Grinnell Williams stripped of his operator's certificate as well. We will be combing through these documents, and uh, if we find any more pertinent information, we will let you know right away. For now, we're live in the newsroom. Jared Worksma, WPTV News Channel 5.